I got a bedroom for you over here. Do your thing. I'm like, what the heck? Is it that easy? So what happened was- Are you guys like seeing how ridiculous this story sounds? Like there's so many potholes. What is going on, man? Welcome back to the Sophisticated Man YouTube channel. I am Tino Regano, men's lifestyle coach. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit subscribe for more men's self-improvement content. So as you probably know, there's a really popular channel right now called Fresh and Fit Podcast. And I've heard a lot about this video. Um, I've seen a lot of the exposing videos from this, but I wanted to react to it myself because I wanted to see how ridiculous it truly is. And the title of this video is how he smashed three girls in one day. So we're gonna see if this is legitimate or if it's just a lot of BS. Let's check out the video. But today we're gonna talk about my W in terms of having three women in one day. Now it sounds crazy, right? But I was kind of foreign to this idea of having multiple girls in one day, because I felt, you know, do the right thing, do the good thing, have one girl I'm talking to, and that's it. But I met this guy at a pool party, he's an NBA player. I won't say his name for, for some reasons, but you know, he's a pretty top tier guy, head value guy, right? Ordering drinks for my friends, and he says, yo bro, What's a good spot to go party at tonight? I told him, look bro, you can go down, down, downtown, you can go to Brickle, Wynwood, doesn't really matter, but I'm going to uh, downtown because it's a really good spot. And then he's like, yo. You're meaning to tell me that a, okay, a high value NBA player like this guy says he is, doesn't know where the parties are at? Like a dude who's literally in the NBA, so who has all these different connections, doesn't know where the parties are at, and he's asking this guy where the parties are? I don't know, it just sounds kind of far-fetched to me. Especially like he just approaches him out of the blue. Like why would, an, why would a professional athlete just randomly see this dude fresh and be like, oh, he, he knows where the parties are. I'm gonna go ask him. Just sounds like, like just ridiculous to me. Oh bro, are you on Instagram? I was like, perfect. Yeah, I am. So I give him my Instagram and lo and behold, he followed me, he said, wait, you know this chick? So he pulls up this, this girl's profile because you can see who's following someone that you just added from like the following list. I was like, yeah, I know her, bro. I used to like do her back in the day. He's like, damn, that's my shorty want to come in town. So basically, we were smashing the same chick. So he's like, yo, dude, you know what? I'm having a mansion party like uh, the next day. Come through, I got you. All this time, you know, we linked up the same night at the party spot I was going to. We connected and funny enough, we dated the same girls like a bunch of them. It was crazy. Okay, so now we're led to believe that this dude and this famous NBA player are smashing and dating the same women. I mean, let's just say for a second that that is true, even though I don't believe it. This NBA player with all these connections is asking this dude Fresh where the parties are, but then go ahead and, and invite Fresh to his own mansion party the next day. Well, why was, why was he asking you for parties in the first place? It's just like, there's a lot of potholes in this story. A lot of the comments on this video are calling him out saying this is all cap. This is lies, so let me know what you think down below. Do you think this is BS so far? Let me know in the comment section. I'm sure as shit, and I'm not believing it. I'm at his magic party, right? There's like 40 girls and like five guys. In my head, I'm like, yo, real talk, this is crazy. Like, I've never been at a party where there's been this much girls compared to guys. So I'm like, yo, how's this gonna work? He says to me, yo, come through, bro. So he's like, yo, pick three that you want, and I got you. I was like, three that I want? Is it like a buffet? Shoot, I'll take it. So I was like, yo, I like her, her, and her. He, he goes tossing him, calls him over, and I kid you not, I got a bedroom for you over here, do your thing. I'm like, what the heck? Is it that easy? So what happened was- Are you guys like seeing how ridiculous this story sounds? Like there's so many potholes, and it, he just makes it sound so easy, so simple. Like this dude just gave him three girls of his choosing and just said, hey man, here's a bedroom, go for it. It's like, I mean, I'm not stupid, I know that like, big time athletes and celebrities have parties like this, but they're not inviting dudes like him. Like Fresh, like who's he to this NBA player? Oh, he saw that he hooked up with the same girl as him? Yeah, right. None of it really sounds legit to me. It sounds like just BS. And uh, a lot of people have exposed Fresh and Fit about their tactics and their ways and their stories. So I'm very skeptical looking at this. This is about a year old video and it's honestly kind of amazing that this video is still up on YouTube. Like he didn't take this down at all. It's still up for people. It's, you can still go view this yourself. So I kind of think it's just funny. It's, it's literally like a, a comical video. So let's see what else is in here, man. Like I, I talked to them real quick. They're mad cool. And 
legit guys i could have had a threesome with them but i was like yo this is crazy like i had no idea what was going on i was like yo this is too much for me but what happened was i did my thing with one of them came back outside hopped in the shower real quick talked to the other one went back in the room later on so basically i had three girls in one night it sounds crazy guys but there's a whole nother world outside of the regular dating circle where guys of high value can actually like set up certain things that regular guys can't so translate that into like my own lifestyle you know, from instagram I said, you know what? I can have three in one day. What can I do myself? Learning from Deals on Demand that you guys are gonna uh, learn if you, if you bought the course. We're gonna re-release it soon, uh, coming up maybe like next month. That whole setup there can be done for yourself. And of course, he has a program where he's gonna show you all the tips and tactics. Uh, it's just straight up lies. I mean, like I said, these guys have built their platform and good for them. I'm happy that they've got the clout, they got the attention. Hey, that's that comes with hard work. I'm not gonna knock them for that but their integrity, their character, the things that they stand on doesn't seem to be very strong. I don't think they have a lot of morals and ethics when it comes to the men's improvement space. I get passionate about calling dudes like this out because there's a lot of impressionable young men on this platform that are looking to guys like this for advice. And they think that this stuff is real so they can go implement it in their own lives. And they're like, hey, I can do the same thing. I can treat women like this. There are legitimate ways to improve yourself as a man, clearly. And there's really good programs out there. There's really good coaches and mentors out there. But there's a lot of scammers. I've seen this dude's program and the sales copy that's in there. It just sounds even more ridiculous. These guys claiming that they, they smashed over thousands of women. Like, get the heck out of here. I'm not buying this story one bit. I'm not gonna completely hate on this channel. It's not what I'm doing. I'm just simply giving criticism and showing and throwing it out there because we need to hold men like this more accountable. I'm not saying that everything they say is a lie, but this story right here, I'm calling BS. That's why I advocate only telling you authentic, legitimate things that happen in my life and sharing that value on my channel because it's stuff that I've been through and it's stuff that I can actually speak on so I know how to back it up. Just be careful who you get information from, what videos you consume. There's a lot of garbage out there. This story in this particular video right here this guy posted, it's just a bunch of BS in my opinion. So if you like the video, give it a thumbs up, comment your thoughts down below. What do you think? Do you think this video is BS? Do you think it's legitimate? You wouldn't think I'm, I'm crazy for calling them out. Let me know in the comment section and let me know what subjects, topics you want me to cover more of on this channel moving forward. Any feedback is always appreciated. Make sure you subscribe, hit that notification bell if you haven't done so yet. All of my plugs and links are in the description down below. And if you want to join my community of like-minded men who are serious about their personal development, you can join that fa you can join that free Facebook group down below. With that being said, man, hope you have an incredible rest of your day. Remember, everything truly does start with you. If you want to see some more videos about men's improvement, all things manhood, lifestyle, and relationship concern, click the video right here, and I'll see you there.